Procedure for Biliary Stent Placement during ERCP Biliary stenting for palliating malignant obstructions of the bile ducts can be performed percutaneously or endoscopically. Required devices for endoscopic biliary stent replacements are an ERCP catheter, guide wire, and a delivery system with a biliary stent. There are four types of Aegis biliary stents. The most popular stent is the double bear Aegis due to its excellent flexibility and conformability and reduced shortening on deployment. Tubular gold markers on the stent increase radiopacity and visibility on fluoroscopy. The guide wire helps cross the stricture and guides the delivery system into place. It can also be used to assess the length of the stricture more accurately. The ERCP catheter is used to cannulate the bile duct and inject contrast to outline the biliary tree and the stricture. The endoscope is passed into the duodenum and the major papilla visualized. An ERCP catheter is inserted through the endoscope and the papilla cannulated. A contrast medium is injected to demonstrate the position and length of the stricture. The stricture is crossed with the help of a hydrophilic guide. The wire may be used to gauge the length of the stricture. Depending on the type of the cannulation wire, it may need to be exchanged for a stiffer wire to allow stent insertion. The ERCP catheter is removed and the stent delivery system advanced across the stricture. The stent is positioned with reference to the radiopaque markers. It should extend 1 to 2 centimeters beyond the ends of the stricture. The restraining sheath is unlocked and withdrawn slowly, maintaining stent position under real-time fluoroscopic control. After the stent is fully deployed, the delivery system is removed. Most stents will not expand fully straight away as the shape memory is activated on warming to body temperature. Stents will continue to expand over several days and balloon dilation is not usually required. Your local SNG Biotech representative will be more than happy to answer the questions and provide assistance if required. Thank you.